A cell is constructed from two redox systems below. Which statement or statements is or are correct for the cell? 1. The cell potential is 1.14 volts. 2. The reaction at the copper electrode is Cu solid goes to Cu2 plus aqueous plus 2 electrons. 3. The silver electrode increases in mass. A. 1, 2 and 3. B. Only 1 and 2. C. Only 2 and 3. Or D. Only 1. If we look at the two redox systems below, so the copper and the silver equilibriums that we've been given and their electrode potentials, if we look at the electrode potentials, the more negative is at the silver electrode. That means the equilibrium is going to go backwards, whereas at the silver, it's going to go forwards. If we rewrite these, we would get Cu solid going to Cu2 plus aqueous ions and two electrons. Then, looking at the silver one, we would get Ag plus aqueous ions plus an electron going to Ag or silver solids. If we look at our one, two and three statements, well we can establish that number two is correct because we've rearranged and we've looked at the electrode potentials to match that equation. Then looking at number three, the silver electrode increases in mass. Well, we've said that silver solid is being produced. If more and more solid is being produced, mass is going to increase, making three correct. So immediately we can eliminate D. We can also eliminate B from our options. For the cell potential, the cell potential would be 0 0.8 minus 0 0.34 to give us 0 0.46 volts. That does not match the cell potential, so it can't be 1. Therefore, our answer for this question is C. The cell potential I've worked out because it's 0 0.8, that's going forwards, but the 0 0.34, well, we're doing the backwards or the reverse of this, so it's negative. Therefore, our cell potential will be smaller. The 1.14 is if you add them, but that's not what we're doing. That's not correct. To get the mark for this question, you need to write C in the answer box.